Hey guys, welcome to the first figure haul of this year. I'm Kyoko. And I'm Zafira. So all of the figures that we're going to show you arrived this year from January till a couple of days ago. So let's start with the first one. We have the pop-up parades of Inuyasha, Kagome and Kikyo. Kikyo. And yeah, overall I'm really happy with how the pop-up parades of them turned out, although they're not 100% perfect, I would say. Yeah, I think the face of Inuyasha and Kagome isn't on point. It, it's Kikyo looks very good. Yeah. And he's so heavy, I have totally forgotten how heavy he is. Yeah. Uh, Tesho is obviously going to arrive someday in the future as well. Yeah, since we uh, ordered all of those pop-up parades in Germany, they take quite a long time until <laughs> they uh, get here. Yeah. Okay, here's the next figure that arrived and it is the Megumi from Kotobukiya. And she's such an awesome figure. I really love the design with the wolf or the dog. And the base looks so awesome as well. It's a simple base, but it just looks awesome. I love the color. And the, the colors are awesome. totally my, my color scheme. Although the dog looks a tiny bit dirty. Yeah, it's better to pose him a bit. Turn to the side so you can only yeah. see one. <laughs> but I'm sure you have seen this figure all over. Yeah. YouTube so yeah no need to talk much about him but he's a cool figure and yeah and you have another one I have him as well right. okay next figure is this uh, noodle stopper Hatsune Miku villain version from Furio she isn't the best figure I have to say uh, she looks kind of flat but I love the design and the colors so much so I'm probably going to uh, Add some uh, shading with pastels or something. A little bit of a repaint. Yeah, I think this this figure in particular would be a great candidate for a little touch up because the sculpt itself looks very nice. I really like it. It's just the colors are a bit flat and the eyes look a bit dead. I think she looks much better in person than in photos. Oh, yeah, that's or true. In, in in video. She's not very photogenic. <laughs> yeah, but she's still cute. And she only cost like 20 bucks or something. Yeah. I have received the last two figures that are missing from the Diamond Select Toys set, which are Genda of the Grey and Nerds. I have totally forgotten that I ordered these, but I think for the price, they are decent figures. They're not the best looking, obviously. Especially Genda looks kind of <laughs> weird and they're. I have had a couple of issues with my other figures as well where they included some accessories which you can't really use. <laughs> they are just useless. They are totally useless. But I think for the price they are very decent figures. And I have to say, a couple of those figures look even better than some of the higher, higher price figures. I don't know, I think they will look good in my collection and that's that. Last two figures. There are my holiest of holiest grails. <laughs> And the first one is it's a Shoboru from Hobby Max. If you want to see an unboxing of him, we have one on our channel. Which you can Check find. it out. I think Hobby Max is a figure manufacturer uh, you should keep an eye on because pricing and quality wise, they're pretty, pretty good. good in our experience. Yeah, and they make interesting kind of figures. They are super over the top, but they're nice and detailed and quality wise they're not 100% perfect there are little flaws here and there but overall great figures great pricing I'm totally keen to see more of them yes and finally the last one missing Inuyasha his counterpart although Sishimuru is my favorite character I think the figure of Inuyasha looks even better because the shading and the sculpt and everything is just amazing. I'm so happy that I have him finally. <laughs> and I can't wait to put these two up in my Inuyasha shrine and yeah, they have them the centerpiece of my, if not the whole collection, <laughs> maybe. So these are all of the figures from this haul. Which one was your favorite? Let us know in the comments and see you in the next video. Bye. Bye bye.